Are we on? Are we on? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Veronica. If you don't know me, I am a licensed esthetician here in Chicago, Illinois, and I own Ario Beauty Bar. So today I'm showing up here because it's been a while and you know, we're we're hanging on for dear life, but we're showing up on YouTube because I have a new product that I'm gonna show you guys. Um, I got a package. I ordered the new brow tint from Brow Daddy. So let's open this up and see what's in here. I'm excited. So excited. Um, okay. So bear with me and my intrusive ADHD thoughts. Um, okay, so we got some little cups, I guess like mixing, mixing cups. Um, looks like we're gonna take some medicine shots, but um, these are cool because sometimes you can't find something to mix your stuff in. So, cool beans, and it looks so cute. Look, all the colors of the rainbow. Wow, what? Look at the packaging, guys. Like, Brow Daddy will always come through with like the glam aesthetic so these are cream developers three percent and i got two of them i don't know if that's like supposed to happen or not because i think it only came with one but i'm not telling if you're not telling so yeah we got two huge developers um each one is two ounces so very nice and first color on here is platinum blondie so it's the lightest color in the collection followed by light brown obviously we can't really see what they look like until we put them on the skin but just so you see like packaging a1 presentation a1 um this one is medium brown what else we got in here honey we got gold brown, more reddish, brownish, goldish hair and skin tones. Um, so it gets a little bit more warm as we go down. Here's bronzer brown. Pretty nice. Warm chocolate. This one's like really red undertone. I don't know how like, accurate it is to what it's going to look like. But here's dark brown. And here's carbon black. So this one, I got like the full starter package. I don't know, whatever you want to call it. And it comes with eight. And I got two of these. I don't know if you guys are going to get two of these. It didn't say I was supposed to get two. I don't remember. I got to go back and check, but I got two. And let's just open one and see what it actually looks like. Excuse the people upstairs. A little bit loud. What? So cute packaging is so nice like and it's like in a pump so easy to get out I don't know like once you start running out of products like am I gonna have to cut this open to take whatever is left out but we'll see when we get there and you get half an ounce but I think it's, it's like a decent amount of product you don't really use much um, and it is a one-to-one -one ratio and the developer time says 10 minutes and then you have six months after opening for expiration so get all the brows in get all the brows in within those six months before they expire sorry my hair is too nose. i like chalk my own hair off during like a britney spears moment <laughs> So I won't stay up. Like, if I put this down, I look like Lord Farquaad on crack. Okay, like it's all different lengths. Like this is the shortest. Like this was not supposed to be bangs. Like I literally cut it. Okay, anyway, not part of the review. But yeah, the packaging is awesome, and I'm excited to try it. I think I'm actually going to laminate my eyebrows and then attempt to stain them so i can show you what it looks like on me so if you want to see 
what it looks like then just keep watching and if the next clip does not show what they look like then i'll probably watch my eyebrows too so keep watching brow daddy new collection hybrid tint collection so far packaging product sizes 10 out of 10 so just for reference these are like my eyebrows i've always had a really good shape like naturally just kidding <laughs> annoying no they've always had a really good shape but they're like not very thick like bushy dark so we're hoping with the lamination and the tint they'll look a little fuller or i'm gonna look like i got caterpillars on my face either way i'm gonna try i'm gonna try it All right, so we got step one on. We use the inlay brow bomber, and this is step one, which is the perm part. That part breaks the bonds in your hair to let you reshape them after whichever way you like. So we're leaving this on for like six to eight minutes. It all depends on how thick your hair is. I think my hair is more in the medium because it's not very fine. It's not super coarse, so six to eight minutes. So guess what? It's burning. Yeah, it's burning because your girl has psoriasis. I have everything, okay? I can never do anything. When I was in beauty school, I couldn't do a lot of because my face was so reactive. You know what? I figured out, like, it has to be my psoriasis. And it's really reactive here and here. So my eyebrows are on fire right now. But it's okay because I'm going to let it burn, baby, like Usher, okay? And just... Just let it do what it does. Just don't do what I do, because you're not supposed to do it, but for the sake of the video and trying this, like, it's spicy. Okay, I took it off. They're like laying pretty flat. Pretty flat. And I already opened it, so it looks all ghetto, but I'm using brow lock number two, and that's what's gonna lock the shape into place. Okay, brow lock is on. Step number two, they're going to stay like this, hopefully. Okay, the brows are laid. They look so good. Obviously, I haven't tinted them or anything, but yeah. Okay, I know I look crazy, but I just mapped my eyebrows with some string. And we're about to dye them. All right, so excuse the non-aesthetic background, but... Sorry, non-aesthetic background, but I'm trying to do all this with one hand, so whatever. Okay, so that little cup didn't really work. It's too deep. So I just, like, put the smallest tiny pump and then, like, the same amount of the developer and the tint. It's on. It's developing. doing its thing. It looks a little dark, but I know it always does in the beginning. We'll see. We'll see when I take it off. All right. Lastly, we use the brow bomber, which is just like nourishing. So afterward, your eyebrows are not all crunchy. The brows are looking good. So yeah, I just did the lamination. The lamination, I used inlay brow bomber and it works so so good um i have pretty like wiry brows and it smoothed them out nicely and the 10 i like it like it took like 10 minutes to develop but it's not like too intense i know it's probably still oxidizing so i might get like darker but what do we think i think they look good like it's all like a different color here because I just waxed them and like it's all red but my gusta I like them um brow daddy I don't know like I still have to try them on other people obviously my skin is reactive I have psoriasis it's a little splotchy because my skin is like flaky so I can't blame it on them that I have skin issues but it looks really good it's giving what it's gotta give Oh my god, I feel so cute. 
I look, they look so good. So good. I have zero makeup on. So all this is the Brow Daddy stain and then inlay brow lamation. It's giving what it gotta give. It's giving what it gotta give. What what else do you need other than like lashes and some good brows and some good skin, but you know. I have psoriasis and we do what we can with what we got. Also, it's a little splotchy right here, but it's not brow daddy's fault. It's because I have psoriasis, so I have kind of like flaky brows, so I didn't really exfoliate beforehand. So that's why, but eyebrows look so good. And you know, if you're scared to get a lamination, uh, obviously in the beginning, like, see? Can you see? Can you see? In the beginning they look like shiny and stuck to your forehead but it's not gonna look like that forever it's just the first 24 hours because you have to let it like set and do what it does and then after that you can wet them or whatever and they'll be back fluffy the only thing that lamination does it makes it easier to brush so if you have like wiry brows they go in like different directions you can just brush them how you want and then just do like a brow gel to like lock them in that place and set girl but i'm about to have these brows every day when i wake up and the tint it depends on everyone's skin type um it lasts between like three to seven days depends how much you wash your face if you have oily skin if you wash your face often it stays on the hair for about six weeks um but yeah other than that you can just fill it in with pencil or powder or whatever you like in the meantime but brow daddy kind of review i guess i i like them um it's like a gel consistency the time i think it takes a little bit longer than like brow code or any other stuff that i use to develop but i feel like i like it a little bit better than brow code i don't know we're gonna have to play with it a little bit more so if you want to come and let me play on your brows come visit me aria beauty bar bye if you want to see more of my shenanigans don't forget to like and subscribe because that's what they say on youtube right